With the average age of Virginia farmers being 58, the need for farm and food entrepreneurship is a critical issue for those just getting into farming. Today we'll be learning from a couple of my Extension colleagues about some key ingredients for ensuring success. I think successful farmer, there is, there is really a very good recipe to be a successful farmer, and that is to be entrepreneur. And all this look at the new opportunities which is on the horizon. I'm going to go ahead and show you a few of those opportunities here in this. If you walk with me, I'll show you those. Areas. One of the things which is really important is to be able to be entrepreneur. Look what has potential, what are the possibilities? You know why? Because chefs are always looking for something new. The culinary industry is always innovating, looking for exciting. What I have in here is a turmeric plant. Actually, turmeric is shown to be uh, through research, clinical research that actually turmeric, fresh turmeric is very good for inflammation and anti-cancer properties. from Virginia State University Cooperative Extension. Two things that I weighed uh, together uh, as, as important for a farmer is actually that they do their research. And knowing and having a network of other farmers, I think one of the biggest things is the isolation that the farmers have, um, whether they're successful or just starting, that they don't communicate to each other or even. About three years ago, Dr. Rafi and myself decided to start a program in the summer to train interested students in becoming farm entrepreneurs to start their own farm. So we've had several graduates to go through, but two of them is, um, in particular uh, want, have now started their own farm. And we learned four key ingredients for farm and food entrepreneurship, communication, networking, innovation, and an overall entrepreneurial spirit. 